All right, folks. One thing that just came to mind that I think <laughs> is a good point. That um, I've said before, if God wanted me to do the church, well, if he did. One of the things on the uh, notice board is if you are unwilling to dance, you're not welcome. And the reason is, is because joy is incredibly important. And if you want good praise and worship, you need joy. You need all of that. You need joy, you need love. So one of the first things that would be taught is about God's love, God's love for you and understanding that and, you know, acknowledging that because that helps you to worship. Joy is what helps you to praise. So every service we will be started with, yeah, playing a song that people can dance to. That, that can raise the joy. It won't be a Christian song, most likely. It probably won't. I mean, there are some Christian songs that can be used. Of course. Yeah, the song Joy is one of them. And then Fight on Fighter is another one that can be used because they have that sort of up-tempo sort of beat. But no, we won't just pick Christian songs just because they're Christian songs. No, it's about picking songs because of the joy that dance and them will give so yeah if you're looking at that then you'll be looking at Bee Gees yeah some of the Bee Gees stuff is fantastic uh, Michael Jackson don't don't stop till you get enough yeah rock with you very good songs yeah very good songs to dance to but yeah yeah, with the Bee Gees? Yeah. There are some incredibly phenomenally beautiful songs there. And to dance to them? Yeah. It's not going to be about whether you can do it on Travolta dance. It's about joy. You're just dancing because you're joyful. That's what it's all about. We like to try and make it into something that it's not. Yeah, there's no point in doing that at all. Yeah. Yeah. Make it into what it is. Dance because you're joyful. Don't dance because you yeah, because there's music on necessarily, but because you're joyful, because you, you have joy and you want to express that joy. Yeah? Bambi, will you stop licking my shoes? Now I say, you've got, you've got toys to play with. Go play with toys. Licking me shoes, you donut. You're a nutter, you're really a nutter. Licking daily shoes all the time. Yeah. But as I say, I mean, it's always been a case for me. Music has always been incredibly important. So, yeah, have music in church. But don't just have church music because it's church music. Have music because it's good. Because it's good music. Well, put it this way, everybody in church, everybody in church has songs that when they hear that song, it lifts their spirit. Why can't you have that in church? Yeah, because surely lifting people's spirits is an important part of it, isn't it? So, yeah. It wouldn't just be songs from my playlist. People will, will be, you yeah, know, welcome to bring their playlist of joy songs in and put them all together. And then basically the computer can choose one for the first song or the first two songs, whatever, um, for that meeting. Yeah. And let people enjoy themselves. Because obviously different songs have different tempos. How you dance that tempo is really, it's you. It's about you. So it wouldn't be a dancing com competition. I've said about um, you know, somebody taking that idea and bringing it into society as a way of raising joy. Well, that's something that God wants. 
Yeah. There's various people that I thought, well, maybe I can let that person deal with it. But clearly not. No. So far, I said I haven't met my wife yet. I've not met the person who's going to be doing that yet. Either. Uh, again, I don't think so. But very important, you know, to bring joy. Because uh, yeah, I've said about the um, River Church, they had the Tuesday night meeting where they were talking about the mental health issues within society. Mental health is often damaged by depression. Depression is a pushing down. Joy is a lifting up. So if you want to deal with depression, bring joy. It's a natural remedy to depression. That's why I did the video talking about dancing for yeah, whatever amount of minutes every day. Yeah, if you can do five minutes, 10 minutes, 15 minutes, 20 minutes a day of dancing, that's going to raise your joy. So therefore, that's that's basically turning depression to sod off. Because joy is so much stronger than depression. Although, it may take a while for that voice of joy to basically come through and push the, the voice of depression down. But you've got to keep on doing it. So yeah, joy, very important to, if God says to me, he wants me to run a church, joy is one of the first things I want to bring in there. And anyone wanting to stifle that, not welcome. So as I say, it's not about saying to people, you must be prepared to be a professional dancer to be of that level of quality. No, it's simply, you have to be willing to dance. Yeah, because we will do that. It's not about being some blinking. I mean, I've been to places, um, I can't remember what they were called. Um, the places that had a bus. They had a bus and they were like a commune sort of um, flower power Christianity. Um, whether they were just a UK thing, I don't know. Probably American as well. I think probably the idea came from America. Um, I can't remember what they were called. But I visited those people. I saw what they were doing. And it was amazing to me that they called themselves Christians. And yet none of them had a Bible with them. So I went once and never went back again. I'm not interested in doing that. Not in any way, shape or form. It's not some happy, clappy, charismatic um, crap either. I'm not interested in that stuff. It's purely about bringing joy. So that when people praise, they really can praise them. Yeah, they can go out and they can have joy and they can learn to bring joy to their own life and help other people to do the same. Yeah. But very important to have joy. Very important to have, uh, have times when you can be joyful. Yeah, because life can be hard. Even church can be hard. Being in church, um, you yeah, know, listen to the ministry you know, singing those songs can be hard. And they, they can be, yeah. So bringing joy as the first thing is, yeah, that's something I would do. So anyway, there you go. I'll leave you with that. Yeah, I think I've made the point. So there you go. You take care. God bless. I'll speak to you soon. Have a wonderful week. Be a blessing and be blessed. Bye-bye.